Well, parents have been lighting up the Your Stories line, asking for answers after a Madison County Karate Dojo abruptly shut its doors. News Channel Line's Rachel Polanski says their kids showed up for practice to find the martial arts facility was cleared out and leaving them looking for answers. Extreme Martial Arts in Oneida proudly lists its principles across its storefront. But some parents say the dojo's owner could learn a thing or two about integrity. It really just hurts my heart. This comes after Haley Chandler and her four-year-old son Mason showed up for a belt promotion. But the doors... It's all gone. ...were locked. He was nowhere to be found. He didn't come in for classes. Uh, he had deleted his personal Facebook page and the web page to the karate studio. Parents immediately took to social media to voice their concerns. But that Facebook group... Now delete it. And the owner's phone number? Your call cannot be completed as dialed. Disconnect it. I wanted to contact you guys because I want to make it aware to our community that this is something that happened and I don't want him to be able to do this in other communities in the future. And Haley's not alone. Other parents also emailed the Your Stories team about the abrupt shutdown. While they'd like to be reimbursed, Danielle W. says, quote, no. I do not think we will ever see any of that money again. All the mats are pulled up. Everything's off the wall. An unfortunate situation, but one that Haley hopes will become a learning opportunity for her son. He has asked, you know, are we going to go to karate? And it hurts me more to have to tell him, no karate today, buddy. You know, maybe we'll go back another day. Meanwhile, Oneida police tell me they have received a complaint about extreme martial arts and they are investigating. Do you have a story you want us to look into? Email us at yourstories at localsyr.com. Rachel Polanski, News Channel 9.